Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Cliff, welcome to Vintage Time. Unfortunately I don't have my tripod today so it's going to have to be a handheld job until I get my tripod fixed or buy another one. Um, today we're going to be talking about the Vostok Red Square. So this is Vostok Europe, not to be confused with Vostok Russia. This watch is actually made in Lithuania and I've been after this watch for some time and it's um, just a beautiful watch considered to be a mid-size watch but it wears quite large and we're going to have a bit of a look at it I'll get rid of the pillow and so just I'll just uh, have it just give you a bit of a look it's beautifully made if I have a look at the back you'll see we have the Saviour Tower engraved on the back limited edition 3000 this watch and um, that's what I like about the Russian watches, you know, there's a lot of attention to detail but you just don't get from a lot of watch manufacturers. Beautiful crown, star engraved in it, has a lovely winding action and even attention to detail of the links in the band. Beautiful solid link um, bracelet with a clasp, hidden clasp. But just as you notice, even attention to detail, the links are made to the same shape of the watch itself. Just beautifully done. So I guess we can run just a, just a few little, I guess, overall specifications. Case is made out of stainless steel. Obviously the dial is black. We have different dial colours, red, I think there's a blue one, silver, so forth. Uh, stainless steel bracelet, solid links. It's got the... Um, push button clasp which is hidden. Uh, it has a date date. There's a date on there, yes. Uh, movement is Russian automatic movement, 32 joules. The actual crystal is mineral crystal. Has a depth rating of 50 meters water resistance but to be honest I would probably only wear this in maybe in the shower if that in the rain. I wouldn't go swimming with it. Um, the case dimensions are 35 millimeters by 14 millimeters thick, um, and the bracelet dimensions 25 millimeters wide by 9.0 inches long. So it has all the you know little features like day night indicator, luminous hands, and of course it has a limited edition of 3,000 as I've mentioned. Um, it's considered to be a men's watch often advertise a mid-size watch for women. I actually think it would be too large for a woman's wrist. Um, it's powered, automatically powered, which means that the winding of the spring occurs automatically when the watch wearer moves his or her arm. So it's not battery powered. So we're looking at an automatic watch, 32 jewels, apparently 32 rubies. Beautiful engraving on the back, the Saviour Tower limited edition and if for those I guess interested in Russian slash Lithuanian watches this is absolutely beautiful. So I might come back and do a weight test and uh, that just see how heavy it is and then sign out. Hello we're back again and we're doing just a basic weight check as you can see, the watch weighs at 176.5 grams, which means this is quite a substantial watch. Not a piece of garbage you buy in a jeweler's shop for a couple hundred dollars. We have a solid stainless steel watch with a solid band, quite thick, quite durable, keeps amazingly good time. So yes, this will you know, feel like a solid piece of metal on your wrist. It's no lightweight watch. And I think that's what a lot of people want, particularly men. You want something substantial. So anyway, I'll just uh, head, head off and um, just a quick review on the watch. And I hope you enjoy it. Okay, take care, everybody. Bye.